basically doing a shopping haul. I did a shopping haul. I said I'm basically doing. I basically did a shopping haul today and yesterday. And I just loaded my stuff up together. So, anyways, if you guys would like to see what I've done or what I've bought or whatever, then just keep it on watching. Let's go. So, I went to Ulta. Got this big old bag. And got this little bag. This is the big bag of stuff that I got. First of all, let me go ahead and put my glasses on. Okay. So, the first thing I got was a new Morphe palette. The 350 Nature Glow Morphe palette. And the next thing I got is this ColourPop um, eyeshadow palette called Yes Please. I got some new concealer by Tarte. This is their creaseless concealer, and this is in the color Tan Deep Sand. So I got two of them because you guys know I love my NARS concealer, which is in the color Caramel. But I didn't have that in stock. So, yeah. But you're going to, you know, get deeper into the video and see why I got these. Next, I got some foundation from the brand Too Faced. And this is the Born This Way foundation in the color Maple some concealer from the brand Too Faced. So this is their Born This Way multi-use sculpting concealer in the color Honey, which is way too bright. I tried to take it back today. They could not let me return it because I lost my receipt. So yeah, whatever. I already opened this brush, but I got this buffer brush and it's the Morphe M444 brush. I got this Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick. This is the Velvet Lip Cream by Stella. And it's in the color Vena. Um, I got this LA Girl Lipstick. Which is in the color Runway. And it's their Matte Flat Velvet Lipstick. And I've um No, I didn't use this one yesterday. But this is what it looks like. And on the other end... You can pop it off and you get, I've already used a little bit, but you get this little um, shine um, lipstick. It's just a shine. This one is like the little matte, but on the inner part right here, you put the little shine lipstick on. I got this glazed, super intense color, extra glossy finish lip paint by LA Girl. And it's in the color Gleam. And this big bag was the Mario Badescu Serum Drops. So I use this. I'm going to start using this at nighttime. Just putting the drops on my face or whatever. So yeah, I got this. This stuff is expensive. It's like $42 or something like that. Anyways, moving on. I went to Dollar General and I got two things from the company Black Radiance. And this was their foundation in the color. What color is this? It's in the color brownie. So this is what it looks like. I like the little um applicator too. That's cute. And I got their contour palette. And then from Walmart, I got these two masks. This is the Gold Revive, the Revive Gold Peel Off Mask. You put it on your face, a thin layer, and you let it sit for about 15 minutes. I leave mine on for about a good 10, 15 minutes. It says leave it on for 25 minutes, but that's if you put too much on your face, then you leave it on for that long. Anyways, but I put a thin layer on, and I wait for about 10 or 15 minutes, peel it off, skin feeling really soft, and then afterwards, I put my sleeping mask on. And just a thin layer all over your face and you wash it off in the morning and after i do that i put my serum drops on my face before i go to bed okay so in this little cute baggie or whatever i'm gonna go ahead and just dig in i've already not opened my stuff look at it uh open it and everything but this is the zulu this is the zulu by juvia's the Zulu by Juvia's, I guess is what it is. So this is from Juvia's Place. This is the palette. I mean, that's the box, actually. You got a bubble wrap. Okay, here's the palette. And it's the Zulu by Juvia's. And this is what it looks like. Let me see if I can... 
Okay, there you go. So this is like a um like a orange. Oh, I don't know. It'll fell off. So it's like an orange color, but a yellow at the same time. And I kind of like it. So, and I've been dying to get that palette. I gotta get the other palette. I think it's called Egypt or something like. No, it's called The Warrior. And it's got all those pretty gold colors in it or whatever. So this is what I got. This is one of the first things out of the little bag. I got this little palette. And this is by Makeup Revolution. And this is their. I think the highlighter palette is not, it doesn't really guide it up. It doesn't say anything up here actually, but this is what it looks like. I got this little, I just saw this at the front when I was getting ready to check out, but this is the cute little um, Morphe sponge that I got. It's called a Highlight and Contour Beauty Sponge. Oh, so for me and my girlfriend, I got this for our hair by Shea Moisture. Um, it's the Purifying and Hydrating Build-Up Blaster. This is basically something you apply on your hair like oil or whatever. And you leave it on. You don't got to wash it out. It just stops build from. It just stops your scalp from having build-up, residue. Stops your scalp from flaking up and stuff. You know, whatever. I got my favorite, favorite little skincare thing that I do before I do my makeup. And this is like, I think I know what it is. But anyways, it's my Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. I already got one in here. It's right here. But I just bought a new one, to be on the safe side, because I'm all, I think I'm almost out of this one, but I don't really use a whole lot. For you guys, what I'm going to do is go ahead and do a makeup look or whatever. So, without further ado, let's go, y'all. I'm going to slide this back, but I'm going to be doing my eyebrows. I'm going to take my Anastasia um, pomade. And I know y'all like my nails. a perfect line I just did uh okay all right so that looks about right until further notice so I'm about to just take my NARS concealer and I'm gonna um clean my eyebrows up the whole time I've been sitting here eating pineapples and doing my eyebrows. Anyways, okay guys, so I'm about to go in with my Juvia's Place palette. And the first color I'm gonna use is, what color do I wanna use first? Okay, so I'm going to go in with this brown color first. It's, it comes on the um, brush really good. Like, look at that. I barely touched the color. And look, I'm barely touching the color. And it's a lot on the brush. That's how you know this. This is a good palette. And the palette was $20 by itself. All of Juvia's Place palettes are $20. Now I'm gonna take this shimmer color. It's like a little shimmer. It's like a little shimmer color. I'm gonna be taking this color here. I'm barely getting any fallout. Like I'm looking. I'm not getting any fallout. I just need to space these two colors out a little bit. For some reason, I love to have three colors on my lid. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna take the color. Okay, so I'm gonna take this color called French Kiss, which is here. And that's just gonna go in the middle. And it's like super pigmented. Okay, so. Okay, it looks pretty good. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and do the same thing with this eye and 
I guess I'm just gonna speed this process up while I'm doing this or whatever. Okay, y'all, all I wanna do is, like I said, pat that out there a little bit and get the blending. So. Clean up any, make sure they don't gonna be up under there. I'm gonna be using, this brush to do to blend out my foundation so yeah i'm a fan of brushes to blend out my foundation i'm not really a fan of sponges sponges are okay but yeah so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take my Too faced foundation and put some on the back just two little mini tiny pumps and i'm gonna put that to the side do i want to use the new tube i just bought no i'm just kidding i'm gonna use the old one it's still a lot in here. Okay. And I gotta redo my eyeshadow. It's so this sponge is like really soft. Go ahead and oh, I can hear the clicking sound, but go ahead and do my foundation. And I'm using my Morphe M444 brush to buff out my makeup because I'm a fan of cleaning my makeup with my brush. And a little on each side goes a long way. You do not need a lot of foundation to pack on your face. And I like the consistency of, and the packaging of this makeup is like really cute. Like, I love it. Oh, let me see. Like, it's super cute. Okay, anyway, so, and um, the consistency of this makeup, it's not runny and too liquidy or anything like that. It's just right. So, I'm just going to go ahead and contour first. Right on the here. Yep. I'm gonna go ahead and contour with my Too Faced Born This Way Multi-Use multi Sculpting Concealer. And this is in the color Honey. I'm just gonna use a little bit of this because I don't want this to be like too bright. So I'm just gonna use that there. Yeah, I'm just gonna use that there. I saw this little technique on Instagram of this girl. Like she had a brighter um, concealer and she used a little bit of the brightest, the brightest concealer she had. <laughs> yeah, 
can't she use a little bit of the brightest concealer she had like this and then the concealer that was like a little more darker and she just and this is the Tarte Crystals Concealer in the color Tan Deep Sand. I wanted to get that really big um, Real Technique body sponge. It's like, it looks just like this, but it's like that big. And when you put it in the water, it gets like that big. People use it on their body and their face. I'm just like, I really want to try that. Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in the color Deep 35. Okay. Oh, wait. Um, I should go Now I'm going to take my Black Radiance palette. Okay, and I'm just going to go in, in this color here, the dark color, and I'm just going to contour. Oh, all right. Eyebrows. Boom. Now it's something else that needs to be done okay and i think y'all know what it is 
So I haven't done anything to my top lip. Because I really don't think there needs to be anything done to it. And I have my highlighter palette from Makeup Revolution. I'm going to set that to the side because I will be using that. These lashes might be thin, but they loop up. The lashes have to loop up in order for me to wear them. If they don't loop up, I'm not going to wear them. So I got my lashes on, y'all. Okay. My Fenty Beauty. So, can't go wrong with that, right? Put some of this on. And then some of this. And there you have it. So, um, I honestly hope you guys enjoyed this look or whatever. Um, I need to pop out my pop socket. Okay. And there you have it. This, that I said dash. That's basically what this is. Um, Perfect spray. Let this dry. This um cover by Too Faced. Too Faced is really good. Like you can't even tell I got it on. Like it just really matches my color. I keep hearing the pop of sound, but anyway, so. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. I'm not throwing on no hair. I wasn't going to throw on no hair. So, I will link, I will link, I said link, I will leave the products down below in the description, in the description box and let you guys know where I went to get the products, how much the products were and all that good stuff. But, and I will also make sure I put the products I used in this video. And without further ado, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.